Well, before we save his crew, we have to actually put him on a team. And that team is going to be not the... Okay, I was about to say, the Thunder would have been cheesy. The Blazers. Let's sign him on a very friendly deal. Glad you like the offer. He's currently a reserve. Let's hope that gets better. With our first spin of the Miracle Wheel. Now, this video is not going to have any challenges. Let me know what you think of the new style. And we're going to get all defensive attributes 99. So all these stats are going up. And now Taco's the starting center as an 82 overall. Luka with his classic triple-double. And I thought he'd have a shot at this, but they're going to give it to AD. He didn't even make a defensive team either. And Portland's fighting in the play-in. And we're going to make our way to the plus, blowing out the Lakers. Taco with a solid 14, 7, and 3. We didn't upgrade his offense. He's just dropping 14 casually. And he had himself an okay year. Five points a game. Eight rebounds. He didn't do too much defensively, but again, he doesn't have tendencies yet. Let's see how they do versus Luka. And well, we kept it competitive, but we're going to lose here in 7. I mean, we lost like this. I don't, I don't really... I, we can't even feel bad about this. All right, well, here's season number two. Let's see what we get next on the Miracle Wheel. We need some offense here. Give us something good, and we're going to go to get... Oh, well, I mean, that helps too. <laughs> okay. So now Taco just has God potential. He's going to be like a 90 next year without the wheel. All right, we got Ja winning MVP. You know, I thought we would get this award, but I guess Nas Reed can have it. And we're a solid team, six seed. Wait, they traded Taco. He's not on the team anymore. They traded Oscar Thompson in a first round pick for Taco Fall. So he's on the Pelicans with Zion now? Taco doesn't even start on this team. He comes off the bench. He only averaged six points a game, but he's going to get better though. We got the Lakers in the first round. Let's see what happens. And that's going to go ahead and be a gentleman sweep. Now this would be very bad if we lost to Portland. Looks like the Pelicans made the right move. Taco with a solid two points. And now we got to play the cheesy Thunder team who has a million draft picks who are just good every video. And we're going to blow him out here in game seven. So we're going to the finals. Taco showing up big, dropping four points. And now we play the Pacers in the finals with Halliburton. I'm well aware of Halliburton's nice, but the Pacers should not be in the finals right now. Let me cook up with Taco real quick with the hook. Hey, that was tough. Well, I guess Taco got himself a free ring and he had a big game, six points, which I scored two of those. And Zion won finals MVP dropping 31, seven and four. Looks like that 99 potential is helping out Taco. He's now an 88. But let's see if we can give some actual offensive ability. All right, what do we got here? And it's going to be unlock. Oh, well, that, I mean, that's perfect timing. Now, the only problem is he's going to have all these badges and he just won't be able to shoot because his ratings still suck. He went up to a 90 overall, but again, don't expect him to start shooting. We got Darius Garland winning an MVP and the Pelicans are the second seed again. Taco averaged less points than he did last year, but now he has every shooting badge. And he did take 0.4 threes a game, but only shot 17% from three. Let's see how they do versus Kyrie in Utah. And that's going to go ahead and be a sweep. Now we got to play the Kings who now have Anthony Davis, but no more Fox or Sabonis. We got a close one here in game seven. AD in the post, maybe going to work on Taco here. There's only two seconds left. You got to shoot something. AD with the post fade. Blocked by Taco. Oh my God. Here comes Whitmore driving. Oh my God. If Herb didn't foul him. Zion dropped in a basket here. Gets fat. Goaltend. It felt like he blocked it a little late, but I guess he was there in time. Tie game. Got to take the lead here. Come on, Zion. Don't sell it. There we go. Whitmore working on the post here. Spin move. Late misses it. Rebound Taco. What a rebound. And they're going to get fouled. Got to make this a three point game. BI. There we Oh, he smoked it. Six seconds left. Whitmore with the ball. Four seconds trying to drop on Herb Jones. Herb Jones plays some great defense. David Mitchell with the midi. No, there's no way. And now we're down three with 40 seconds left. They're still going to try to go to the post here with Zion. Zion. Wow. Okay. He got an open lane to the basket. And now for the random foul here with 27 seconds left. Probably going to do it. Yep. There we go. Six seconds left here. They're probably going to go down to Zion yet again. Zion working in the post here. Driving to the basket. Oh, Keegan Murray. No way. You smoked. That. Did he get that off? Did he get that off? Let's go to the booth on this one. There's 0. 0.5, 3, 2, 1. Oh, he didn't get it off. There's no, yeah, there's no, oh my God. How do we lose like that, man? That was such a bad way to go off the Davian Mitchell contested midi and then the blow it in overtime. And the Cavs won the championship. Donovan Mitchell finals MVP. And Taco went off five overalls. He's now at 93. But let's see if we can make him better. We need some tendencies or just some shooting attributes. Okay, plus 25 to all tendencies. That's perfect. Perfect. This man's shot tendency was 43 before this. Let's see if he can put up better numbers. All right, LaMelo MVP. And Taco finally made a defensive team. And he's got the Pelicans as the fourth seed. And he's had his best season yet, 13 and 11. We'll take that. While shooting three threes a game and shooting 40% from three. If you were curious, he still has all the shooting badges on Hall of Fame. And now we got to play against Ja in the first round. And well, that's going to be a gentleman sweep. Now we got Houston with Jalen Green and Jabari. And they're going to gentleman sweep us back. That's nice. Taco played solid in the playoffs and he shot 48% from three. And the Cavs went back to back. Garland getting the MVP now. And now Taco's tied for the highest overall on the team, and he got a four-year, $170 million extension. I'm happy Taco got his money, but we want to win a championship with him as the best player. So let's see what we're going to get next, and it's going to be plus 30 to all shooting attributes. That's perfect. And now Taco's officially a 99 overall. Now the final boss got an MVP. We've been waiting for this one. Finally got it. And the Pelicans are the third seed. It's crazy that Taco's our best player, but he's like the sixth leading scorer on his own team. Let's hope we can change that in the next few years. And the Warriors are going to blow us out here in game seven. A rough couple seasons. Here. I mean, Taco played great in the playoffs, 19 and 11, and shot 46% from three. Definitely can't blame him and the Rockets win the championship. Don't 
don't really need to look at player progression anymore. We just have to get the right attribute upgrades and tendency upgrades on the wheel. So let's hope we get one of them right here, and it's gonna be unlock all playmaking badges. Okay. Not too sure what this does for us, but uh, you know, I guess we'll take it. Let's see if Taco can average a triple double. Luca out of nowhere on the Clippers, and Taco going back to back on Defensive Player of the Year. He is yet to make an All NBA team. I'll let you know when he does. And the Pelicans won 63 games as the first seed. Well, at least now he's the fourth leading scorer on his own team as the best player. We're getting there. And the Lakers have Siakam and OG. What the hell happened here? And we're just barely gonna scrape by here in Game Seven. Actually, this might have been Game Six. My bad. But you get the point. We still won. Wow, and Taco had a triple double. And now we have the final boss in the second round. And we're gonna gentlemen sweep him. Wow. Taco with 31, 15, and 9. He's putting up crazy numbers. And now we gotta play this tough OKC team. And we're going to the finals, winning here in six. And he won Western Conference Finals MVP, dropping 16, 10, and 7. And now we play the Algo, the Cavs. Let's see what happens. Well, there wasn't much Algo there. That's gonna be a sweep. And the Pelicans win the championship with Taco winning finals MVP, averaging literally the same numbers he averaged in the conference finals. Not sure how much better Taco can get, but let's see what we got. Maybe some playmaking attributes, something like that. Plus five to all tendencies. That's even better. This man might average 30 a game. And there goes an MVP for Taco dropping 25, 13, and 9. How is MVP Taco only the fourth seed? At least he's finally the leading scorer on his own team. Let's see what he's got versus Luka. Looks like he's got a whole lot of nothing. That's gonna be a gentleman sweep. I mean, I don't really know what else you want to ask from Taco here. <laughs> like, what else was he supposed to do? That's a rough year, man. And the Raptors win the championship. Scoot finals MVP. Well, let's see what we got next. Again, not too sure how we can really make him any better, but I guess we'll take what we can get. Plus 10 overall. I, okay. Here we go. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Cool. Let's see if that does anything at all. Taco going back to back, and the Pelicans are the fourth seed again. Just gonna confirm this one more time. He is the leading scorer on his own team. And we gotta play Bancaro. They don't have John anymore. And that's gonna go ahead and be a gentleman sweep. Now we gotta play. Okay, this is a super team. Well, the super team is no match for Taco because we got another gentleman sweep. And now we gotta play Garland. He's so cheesy in the Sims. Well, apparently not cheesy enough because that's gonna be a sweep. And now we play the Raptors in the finals. This is a pretty good team. Just gotta close this one out. And Taco's bringing the ball up. Okay. Oh my god, why'd he shoot that? Oh, that was money! Scoot with the three. That might go in. Oh my god, that was nasty. How will the Pelicans respond? Richardson from three. Oh my god! Dude, this dude is clutch! Henderson with the midi. Oh, he smoked it. Taco with the rebound. He's gonna get fouled. Blackburn driving. That's a terrible lap. Alright, that'll be game. And Taco ended this game with a triple-double. And he averaged a triple-double in the entire finals. And it looks like Taco decided to take his talents elsewhere. And he chose the Suns. This team's definitely worse than what he had before, but okay. Okay, we're running out of stuff here on the Miracle Wheel. He's just He's like, what else is he going to do? The man is a 7-6 walking triple-double. Not sure you can get too much better than that. Another plus 10 overall. I guess he's getting some more speed out of that. That helps. Taco's still stacking up MVPs. And he's got the Suns in relevance. There's really not a lot of good players on this team. He's gonna have to carry. Especially against Victor. Well, so far, Taco's been cooking Victor this whole video. And he got locked up 7 points for Victor in a closeout game. And now we have the Super Team Clippers. Yeah, this team is pretty toxic. I understand us getting swept. There's only so much a 7-6 center who can hezzy tween splash again assist and get triple doubles can do. He's got two years left on his contract. Let's see what we got next on the Miracle Wheel. And it's gonna go ahead and be unlock all finishing badges. Okay, that's new. He already had a good amount of these on gold, but just getting all these on Hall of Fame is insane. These are pretty much guaranteed at this point. And we're the second seed playing Big Carroll in the first round. Gonna blow him out here in game six. Now we gotta play this stack Clippers team again. Trying to stay alive here. Down 3-2. Taco gonna use the screen. You're gonna fade away from three! Oh, you gotta knock that down, Taco! Shea gonna use the screen, gonna pull up from mid-range. Oh, he knocks that down. That might be the dagger. Well, Taco, what are you gonna do? He sets the screen here. Another fadeaway three! Oh my god, Taco. You guys had this game in the bag. Just blew it. I'm not gonna lie to you guys. I think I've spun the wheel like five times already because I just keep landing on things that are redundant and we already have a 99. So, um, okay. 10 is not 100. That's a good one. So now Taco is going to be toxic. How did someone beat Taco in the MVP race? At least he still got defensive player of the year. And the Suns are the third seed. And the Suns play this stack Clippers team in the first round, but they don't have Luke anymore. They got Halliburton now. And we're gonna get him out of here in six. Now we got our former team in the Pelicans who have gotten really good since we left. Well, I'm giving him a chance here in game seven. Oh my god what a pass right there taco gonna go up with that oh my god we need a bucket quicker oh my oh he smoked it yeah come on Taco. gotta cook up here buddy oh that's a terrible shot oh he made it oh my god he pulled a fade away not a fade away but you know you know what I mean? wow taco you cannot let that happen well they put up a good fight but it is what it is taco's got one year left on his contract and this will probably be our final miracle will spin because he literally just can't get any better the only possible thing he can get is athleticism and like i mean that's such a low chance of even happening so yeah we just gotta knock off finishing badges some of them fell down the gold and silver so i'll put him back up the hall of fame but this will be his final year until i send him to retirement but solid getting another one and the sons of the second seed hopefully 2k gives us that cinder 
Cinderella story we all want. And we got the Jazz in the first round. This team sucks. That's going to be a sweep as expected. Now we got to play the Rockets, who are pretty good. And we're going to blow them out here in game six. Now we're in the conference finals versus the Blazers. This team's terrible. Never mind. I don't know ball. Yeah, this team's way better than us, and they just swept us. I just don't get how Taco loses this series in a sweep. I just, there was not one player even close to being better than him. And the Nets win the championship. Victor follows the MVP, of course, the final boss. And now I'm going to sim all the way to his retirement. All right, Taco played two more years and eventually retired. Here's all his career averages. Some pretty good stuff here. Gives him an overall of 18, 10, and 6. That's not bad. He was a five-time MVP and a three-time NBA champion and somehow got 21 assists somewhere. He was inducted into the Hall of Fame. He's 78th all-time in points, 89th in field goals. He's 22nd in rebounds, 53rd in assists, 7th in blocks, and 24th in steals. Well, Taco, glad we could help save your career. Goodbye.